Let's graph the linear equation y equals 1 fourth x plus 2. And we're going to do this two ways. First, we'll use a table of values to draw the graph here for the y equals 1 fourth x plus 2. And then we we'll use slope intercept formula, y equals mx plus b, to check our work. I'm going to choose numbers here. I can choose any numbers to put in for x, but if I choose them wisely, it'll make this a lot easier. So if I chose 4 for x, that would mean 1 fourth times 4, that would equal 1. 1 plus 2 equals 3. So that's a little bit easier to work with. That would give us the point 4 comma 3, and that fits on our graph paper. Next, I'm going to put 0 in for x. So if I have 0x, 1 fourth times 0, that's just 0. 0 plus 2, that's 2. So I have 0 comma 2 as my points. And finally, let's just put negative 4 in. If we put negative 4 in for x, 1 fourth times negative 4, that's negative 1. Negative 1 plus 2, that's just 1. So these are the final points here that we'll use. We could just use 2, but if you use 3, in case you made a mistake, that helps you catch it. So now we just graph these points here on our graph paper. We have x is 4, so let's go over 1, 2, 3, 4, and y is up to 3. That's our first point. Then we have 0 for x, y is 2, and finally negative 4 for x, 1, 2, 3, 4, and then 1 for y. And you can see they're in a line there. We can even put a line through that. And we'll put arrows here to show that it goes to infinity. And this is the graph for y equals 1 fourth x plus 2. Again, we could choose any values, but by choosing values that give us these whole numbers, that does make it easier to graph. If we wanted to look at slope-intercept formula, so with slope-intercept form, b, that's the 2. So that's where we'll intercept the y-axis, at 2, right there. Then the slope, that's 1 over 4, and that's rise over run. So we go to our y-intercept, we rise 1, and we go over 1, 2, 3, 4. Likewise, from this point, we could rise 1 and go over 1, 2, 3, 4. And that would also be on a graph if we extended it. So that's just another way to check our work. This is Dr. B with the graph for y equals 1 fourth x plus 2. Thanks for watching.